Someone contacted me this morning telling me that she passed her IELTS. Congratulations if you are the one. So I decided to actually make this search today for new job opportunities for both nurses and for healthcare assistants with visa sponsorship. So if you are struggling to get a job, this video is for you. So let's get started. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello and welcome. My name is Linda Aze and on this channel, I share information about nursing abroad, getting jobs abroad, remote job opportunities worldwide. So be sure to subscribe and always come back for more. And for my returning subscribers, thank you so much for your feedbacks and for always coming here. I appreciate it a lot. So let's get... I've divided this video into two. The first group that I'm going to be mentioning is for nurses and they offer visa sponsorship. And for the second group will be for healthcare assistant jobs as well with visa sponsorship. I already shared some of this in my telegram group. Or yeah, but there you go. The first one is a care home that is located in Crowley, West Sussex area. So they are looking for a nurse to join them and they included that they are going to provide visa sponsorship if you need them. So it is a care home job and so for their requirement they say you need to have a minimum of 6 to 12 months nursing experience that you must be passionate about. You'll be able to up-to-date clinical practices that means that you maybe you are practicing wherever you are from and then that their salary is fifty one thousand pounds per annum which is really really cool 20 approximately 20 or 20.5 pounds per hour right and they also have other interesting bonus like annual loyalty bonus of one thousand pounds company maternity pay 35 days annual leave i mean this is really very interesting bank holiday enhancements um regular clinical supervision free access to online learning and all of these things so make sure you uh, you actually apply for this job because i believe this is really cool the second home pays for eight thousand pounds per year and it is also a nursing home as well that is based in Ledbury, Hertfordshire, Hertfordshire area. So this is also a very interesting one. It is in a care home and they will require you to have a pin. But if you go down, they use, if you require tier 2 visa sponsorship, they are happy to provide that. This is really interesting. And for my friend that has already passed her IELTS, yes, come on. This is an opportunity for you. You need to apply for this one. They also have other benefits as well, just like the other ones. So make sure you go through the benefits. But if you already passed your IELTS and you are looking for nursing role, here is one for you. The next one pays a lot less and it is called the supervised practice nurse. Now, this one pays £12 per hour, which is like the average for people that work with the NHS especially. So, it is also a very good one and it is a care home as well. In they have a lot of benefits as well, free parking, refer a friend bonus and all of that. And they say that applicants who require tier 2 sponsorship to work in the UK will be considered and they added applying now, which is really very, very interesting. Okay, these jobs were just posted this March. So you have opportunity of applying and the deadline is April. All of them are saying that they are sponsoring tier 2 visa. The next one, I actually like the title for this one. They said, Internationally Educated Nurse Awaiting PIN. So this particular one was posted on the 10th of March. They also included that they provide tier 2 visa sponsorship if you need it. Okay, so this is also very good. They said they are paying the average one that many people actually get. This is an NHS trust and they are paying 25 to 31,000 pounds per annum. This is The unfortunate thing about this one though is that they included that they will not consider any applications from those on the red and amber list of countries. So it makes what some of you are sending to me actually valid. And this actually makes it valid that some NHS trusts are no longer considering from abroad. But these nursing homes that I posted, please go ahead and apply. Go ahead and apply. If you are in some of those countries that are not in the red list or amber list, then this is an opportunity for you. The next care home that offers visa sponsorship to everyone is this is called the they said it's based in Gloucester 
and this particular job they pay 19 18 to 19 pounds per hour which is really very cool and it is closing on the 22nd of april this is for nurses and they are willing to also sponsor your tier 2 visa they are willing to sponsor tier 2 visa so go ahead and apply for this one as well they've got a lot of benefits that they listed over here and you want to check so the next group is going to be for support workers and for healthcare assistants with visa sponsorship one thing i would say though is that when i keep searching for this thing i keep seeing novo care and all of that some of you have already applied to novo care in the past some people are still sharing opportunities for novo care please if you've got any offer from novo care please i would like to hear from you so that, so that other people that are applying we have hope of actually getting in in novo care as well so this first one is for senior care assistant and it is by Barchester Healthcare, okay? So they posted this on the 15th of March and it is closing on the 14th of April. Now I tried to look to see if they included that they are sponsoring tier 2 visa and they made mention of nothing like that. But I've mentioned Barchester in one of my videos when this healthcare assistant jobs with visa sponsorship started. So I believe that if they didn't mention it, it is good for you to try to apply so and see the kind of reply that you will get from them now if they say they are not recruiting then it is okay but if they are then it is good for you as well okay so they have a lot of benefits they have a lot of free learning and development and a range of holiday retail and leisure discounts so it is actually a good company if you get an offer with them the next one is for senior co workers as well. So this particular one is also was also posted on the 13th of March and they pay 12 to 15 pounds per hour. I found this job very, very interesting. But one thing with this one is that they say they are only sponsoring tier 2 visa for those that are already in the UK. I included them in this video because some people are already in the UK but they are not and they want to change their visa to tier 2 visa. So they included that if you're already in the, in the UK, if you're a student and you want to change your visa, this is an opportunity for you. Since they included it, then it is good. So some of their requirements is that you need to be able to drive and all of that. You need to be fluent in English. So if you're a student, this is perfect for you. If you want to change your visa from tier 4 visa to tier 2 visa, here is an opportunity for you. Good thing is that they say, they say that they are also going to provide full training opportunities for you. So if you're a student and you're worried that you don't have MVQ and all of that, they said they are providing full training and induction for this role and progression available. They will also train you on MVQ level three, which is really very cool. So make sure you apply for this one if you're already in the UK. Now I'm keeping an eye for any healthcare assistant role that comes off. I already shared this website in my Telegram group and I keep, I keep an eye on healthcare assistant roles. Some agencies that have contacted, they said they, that their slots are finished, but when it comes out, they will let me know. So I will keep... I'll keep up with them and I'll keep searching as well. I know some of them are not really coming up recently, but I'll keep searching for them. You can join my Telegram group. I usually share, I know it's not very consistent, but I will do my best now that I have a little leave on my hands. And I wish you the very best if you have applied or if you are waiting for response or if you are going for interview, make sure you watch my video about interviews. I know that it is a second part of that video, but watch it if you are going for interviews. It is going to really help you. I will see you in my next video. Bye.